Hey guys, uh, Thomas here. Happy birthday. <laughs> My birthday was about two weeks ago, so I had some, some balloons. and uh, So, um, I'm just celebrating my balloons. <laughs> so the, today's video, I'm talking about Barry and, uh, and us. Um, this story takes place in, uh, I believe, 1986 or 1987. Um, he was about maybe in, in May, May, June. Uh, he was living in College Park at the time. So <clears throat> Barry came over. Like uh, for the weekend, you know, that was uh, you already heard the story of our DC trips of, of one of our DC trips where he spent the night uh, with me and we, um, you know, we were chilling. So, um, the next morning, um, you know, we got to eat, and, and you know, as a college student, didn't have much and uh, had that much funds. So, but I was able to scrap, a, scrap up a couple dollars for some uh, for breakfast, and uh, I said, Well, Barry's like, you know. Let's go get some some food. I said, okay, no problem. So, uh, so I said, well, you, you go ahead and chill here. I'm going to go around to uh, the local um, like a 7-Eleven or a thrift store uh, to go get some, um, some get some supplies. Okay, so um, so we went to a local store. He drove me over. So we went to uh, so we went to a store and so our, so we so uh, we go get the pancakes, okay, Aunt Jemima, always Aunt Jemima, we, uh, and we got uh, some syrup, you know, the local syrup. Uh, we always kept it with Aunt Jemima also, that's our syrup at the time. And at the time, you know, I'm you know, 20, 24, 25 years old, so, you know, um, I didn't have, um, so I didn't, I mean, I, I ate and I exercised, but, you know, I was more health conscious than I am now. So, and then we could say that for both of us. So, but um, at the time, um, penny pinching was definitely the way to go as opposed to full out spread. Because we didn't have the money to go to uh, IHOP or Bob Evans or any other place. So, you know, we, and plus our parents cooked. So, and we've cooked breakfast for self, for ourselves before. So it was no big deal thing. So, so we went to the store. And so, uh, so I'm, I'm, we're in the store and uh, we go get some bacon. All right. So, I'm, you know, I'm penny pinching and trying to get things done. And it's like, okay. All right. So, um, I found some turkey bacon. This is back in 1985, so this is a newfangled thing, you know. Now you can pretty much find it everywhere. So I got some, some turkey bacon, and so I bought it. I said, "Okay, we got some turkey bacon, so we good." And at that time, it was cheaper than regular bacon, uh, something like the Oscar Mayer or whatever. He 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 flew off the handle. He's like, "Man, what are you doing?" I said, "Just go get some turkey bacon." I've never had turkey bacon before. Because uh, all bacon I wanted to get was, was regular, the pork, pork. <laughs> He's like, what are you doing, man? I want no turkey bacon, man. What's going on with you? I want some real bacon. I said, but the real bacon costs more. He said, don't, don't worry about it, man. Just put that stuff back. I'm going to get this. Okay. All right. So, all right. Okay. All right. So, we switch out the turkey bacon for the regular bacon. So, brought it back to the house. Did what we need to do. Everything was cool. Okay. Fast forward 30, 30 years now. Uh, he won't eat anything pork now. He's not Muslim. Uh, but he said, no, I'm not eating that. Nope, nope. I said, well, uh, 30 years ago when I bought some, uh, when, we went, when you came over to the house when I was in, in College Park, you had a hissy fit because I bought some turkey bacon. Now you want turkey bacon all the time. What the, what's going on? Oh, man, things change. Things change. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. But you flew off the handle about, you know, we could have had it back then. I said, no, 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 no pork. I don't want no pork. So, okay. So, so he wouldn't touch any of the pork. He wouldn't eat any. Uh, he bought, uh, he had gotten a pizza, a pepperoni pizza, and he had a, he had half pepperoni, half ch cheese. 
in her room was making that. He tried to slice it, and he said, man, that stuff tore my stomach up, you know, dealing with the, with the grease and all that sort of stuff. So, man, I can't leave that stuff, so I had to leave it alone. So, yeah, so, uh, yeah, he, he, he wouldn't um, do that, but we had this big thing 30 years ago because of it. But, you know, for, for me, I can do both, okay? Uh, you just have to choose wisely, but you also, you know, uh, turkey bacon. My, I have some in the freezer. Matter of fact, my wife cooks it all the time if she, if she wants to. But I can do both. But, you know, it's, but, you know, it's, it's it, it is what it is. I'm serious. It is what it is. So, um, let put your, put your comments down below if you had this debate. Um, you know, I'm, I know about Muslim faith and I know about the health concerns and things like that so you know just you know put drop me a line and, and just tell me uh, for you what's better turkey or uh, or either uh, tofu bacon <laughs> or you know the regular pork bacon so you know just drop me a line you know uh, thank you very much for if you uh, for coming to the channel and enjoying the content please um, check out my affiliate links below and uh, you guys take care um, drink plenty of fluids get some exercise kiss your loved ones and thank you so much take care bye bye